Hello everyone and welcome back to part number 11 of the 100 baby challenge and our little Sophia is aging up. Now I was going to skip through the night but she decided to ruin that plan and age up so hopefully she shakes her little tush and we'll see what kind of teenager we have. Alright so because of her success in school we can choose a treat for her. Excellent. So she's friendly, she's excitable and she is... A great kisser. Well, well, a great kisser. Excitement, much excite. So let's rub, rub herself. Go, <laughs> let's, run, let's run herself into Enras. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, a foot and mouth. Let's go into Enras and have a look at. She looks kind of pretty. So let's see what we have. We'll do the quick makeover and you'll get to see what she's like. So here she is, little Miss Sophia, and I think she is freaking beautiful. She's got quite heavy eyebrows and a, a quite a, I don't know, a deep set eye, but I just she looks a bit different, if you know what I mean, but she's gorgeous. So, as always, what I like to do is have a little look at the hairstyles with you, then I'll do the makeover off camera and then show you it at the end. But I do like to show you, obviously, you know, the hair, oh my goodness me, how cute. That's the hairstyle. Like, I don't even have to look any further. That is her hairstyle. That is gorgeous. She is a beautiful girl. So I'll do the rest of her makeover and come straight back to you. Alrighty, and here is our Sophia. She is cute. So I went for a custom content dress, just some base game tights and these boots as well. Again, they're custom content. I don't know where I got them from, but if you like them, I will try and remember. I'm going to start noting down all my custom content places because I know that you guys obviously want to know if you see a piece of custom content that you like. Alright then, so... And that is her all set up. And what I've also done is I've purchased a couple of B things because I felt that we needed some money, you know, making stuff. So she's checking out new object. So why don't we feed the bees? Feed the bees. Now the boys, you just have to come inside. So please come in here and eat some waffles. We have Spencer fixing our freaking laptop because as always, things love to break, don't they? They really do love to break. So she's doing that. What is going on with that outfit? Oh right, okay. I understand now. It makes sense now. <laughs> Um, welcome to the world of scuba diving. I don't really care what he's up to. I really don't. Our little baby girls are playing with the book. Portia is playing with the book and Nicole is playing with that. So once Natasha is done, she wants to potty train Portia. Does Portia need a pee? Portia and her pee. She kind of does. And here is the stupid mascot. I mean, really? Let's go ahead and potty train Portia. And Spencer, my sweetheart, before you go to bed, please potty train your baby sister, Nicole. That'd be great. Now, someone pointed out that I should just really... Well, what are you... Boys. Boys, 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 boys. What did I tell you? Come on inside. Move your little bahookies inside, please. Thank you. You're going to catch your absolute chills outside. Right, so yeah, some of you told me just to get the potty training over with, just to fire them on the potty time after time until it's done. So I think we'll probably just do that. <laughs> I think we will. I think we will just keep doing that with them. Um, She wants to see Sophia graduate, which we can do. She wants to see so or sign her up for an after school activity. So we'll do that because that's nice and easy. It wants the teacher to derive as well. So I really do like the bees because I think it makes you good money. However, however, we all know that, you know. Thank you very much, Lama, for your donation. 20 simoleons. I do appreciate it. So, yeah, it's it's fine apart from the fact, no, don't go and play in the igloo or check for monsters. Go and eat some leftovers. And how are you doing, little Molly? She's going to go and get something to eat. She's first in the queue. She's like that. You can wait your turn, boyo. 
Sam, once you're done there, I need you to go and use the bathroom. Because otherwise you're going to pee all over the place. Spencer is majorly tired. Yeah, so the bees, I would love it if we didn't have to hear that constant buzz. So what I might do is put it away from the house. Because I really don't know how I'm going to feel about constantly. Yeah, actually. Let's just go ahead and do that now. And I know it's a bit of a pain that they're like way over here in the lot, but I can't listen to it. Like, I just can't. Right, so our next target then for baby daddy. So we are pregnant currently with Osvaldo's child, or children, hopefully. So our next target is Mr. Walter Kincaid for sure. Okay, you can use the bathroom. Nicole, my sweet, you can come back and play with your music. And what about you, mister? So you can... Where is your bed? Sleep. There you go. On you go and sleep because you've got school tomorrow. I also got a decent amount of money now from consigning and a whole bunch of other stuff as well and selling the Christmas presents. So I'm thinking about investing in another all-in-one bathroom. I think that that's definitely something I'm going to do. What are you going to... Are you... Yeah, you're in bed now. That's good. So can you also use the potty? The potty? No, <laughs> the bathroom. And then I also want you to go to sleep as well. Okay, so we're getting there. We are getting there. So we're going to go ahead and potty train her here. Because this isn't quite as... Uh, you know, quite as full. Oh no, well, okay. It's full anyway. So let's go ahead and do that. So I hope you're all having an amazing, amazing, amazing week. Um, thank you guys so much for all your kind responses and comments and everything on my other baby challenge videos. I really appreciate it. I really do. You're standing in pee, Molly. Go, don't stand in your sister's pee. So, yeah, I really appreciate all the comments and all the suggestions and everything you have. It, it does mean the absolute world to me. I've said it before, but I'm never going to stop saying it because you deserve to be thanked. I don't care what Santiago's up to. I'll need to change my notifications. Right, so hopefully this will do it. Thank the Lord. Now, we haven't been getting the the kind of music. I don't know why. Whenever they complete. Oh, she's found out she's pregnant as well. So we're not getting that. I don't know why, but... Everything else seems to be working okay, so I'm not going to panic too much. I have reset the time, but it hasn't done much, to be honest. She wants to eat mac and cheese. I don't know if we know that recipe yet, but let's promise the graduation one, first of all. Are you going to eat those disgustingly burnt waffles? You are. You are. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough but she's pregnant now I do want to try and get her to have a perfect pregnancy because if you've watched April's video recently she had a perfect pregnancy and she oh it's so funny guys if you've not watched it go and watch it because she actually <laughs> is so excited to have a perfect pregnancy she, she bursts into manical laughter and it's hilarious it really is so Hopefully, if this hurries itself up. Sometimes this, I don't know if it's this town, some custom content worlds are temperamental, let's just say. They are temperamental. And she hates her fridge. I would love to swap out the fridge. I probably will do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get her to clean this up and get into her bed -aroos. And we'll pick up in the morning when she's actually doing something interesting. <laughs> Alrighty, and we are up and about now, and we are going to go and potty train our little baby Nicole. So let's go ahead and do that. And let's just get that out of the way. What is wrong with you, sweetheart? You're needing the toilet, so why don't you come here and use the potty chair because you know how to do it. And once again, it's thundering in this place. Once again. So once we've done that, I'm going to put the twins to bed and then invite Mr. Walter over because I do want to, as I said before, get to know him. Hopefully he can come over. I don't know what kind of job he has, but, you know... We'll see, we'll see, and I think I definitely am going to buy another all-in-one. Yeah, I definitely think so. I think it's important that we're at this many sims, we're pregnant with more. You know, it's kind of important that we do 
Oh, there you go. I got the the notification there. How bizarre is that? Sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't. Weird, 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 weird. So let's put our little darling here in the crib. I love Nicole. I have got a friend called Nicole. And do you know, she's actually the nicest person you'll ever meet in your entire existence. Like, no joke. She never has a bad word to say about anybody anybody even if the person's a complete and utter walloper you know that nobody else likes you know because they've done ridiculous things she will not say anything she'll try and find something nice about them and she's just she's like an angel <laughs> i know that sounds pretty weird actually but she genuinely she is like a little angel and yeah, I love her. So, what are we? What, what are you doing? I never said teach to talk. She needs to sleep. Okay, that's that's my fault. Let's put it in the crib, please. Put portion in the crib. Oh, Elton and Dalma got into a heated argument. Maybe it's because he had a baby with you, perhaps. Get a part-time job to improve your school performance. Um, I don't. Hmm. No, because I kind of I want her home with me. <laughs> To help me out. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I want. Right, so go ahead and get Little Miss here into... Have I sorted my timer? Oh my goodness, I don't think so. This, you know... <laughs> you would think that this would be easy to remember to set a timer. But it, it's not. Because, you know... You know, I, I'm rubbish. So come and mop this up really quickly. And then we'll invite over... Um, improve your writing skill for Spencer. Yes, we can do that, Spencer. Absolutely. So come ahead and do this. Oh my goodness. Drop off. Yes. Permission slips. Absolutely. Um, right. So possibly by the time we get ourselves put together, um, Spencer will be home, which means we could technically go out and meet him if we wanted to. But it's good for her to stay home and also... Hmm. Oh, it's a quandary. It's good for her to stay at home and also, uh, you know, hear the music and whatnot. So what I'm going to do as well, let's just, uh, this house is getting to be a bit of a, <laughs> a disaster, this mess. I want to buy a TV because someone told me that having a TV would also increase the chances off why can i not that having a tv would also increase the chances of triplets so whether that's the case or not i'm not entirely sure but we will see absolutely right let's try and get this there we go into the corner and we can still have this kind of in the middle of the floor there's no harm in that right excellent so I probably actually just get her. Well, she's actually using it already. I'll probably get her to come and serve some mac and cheese. I think she wanted to eat mac and cheese at one point. Yeah, I think she did. I think she did. Pile of permission slips. My goodness, we've got lots of permission slips um, to get dropped off. Okay, so the all one bathroom costs is four grand. We've only got four grand, but we do have a painting to sell and hopefully she can work on her garden and things like that 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 doesn't even make sense no it doesn't it really doesn't okay let's fast forward through this exciting part all the yes absolutely any field trips are good because sometimes they can come home with expensive stuff which means that we can sell them absolutely right so where are we so i want you just to drop off the permission slips after school you as well did you have anything to do no i don't think you did and you to improve your writing skills so spencer and our sophia are home fabulous so what i'm going to do someone also told me honestly god you guys are the bee's knees because see if it wasn't for you i would not know that doing your homework on the multi-tab helps your fun as well i mean that's how awesome you are so she's like that Ooh, the tv so let's turn that on and let's uh oh no 
What? Can we not change it? What? Do we not have the option to change this to kids TV? Be kidding me on. I thought we said that this was like... But you can do it on the old timey telly, so how can you not do that? Um. Hmm. Well, that's irritating. Cooking, athletic, gardening, fishing. Right, okay. I'm a little bit... I'm a little bit upset. I thought we were buying the right one. Okay, obviously not. Obviously not. Right, never mind. Don't worry. Don't worry about it, Laura. Don't worry. It's good to have a TV anyway. Because she can watch it. What is she actually doing? She's reading a pregnancy book. No. I need you to get your fun up, so watch the TV. Seriously. Natasha, you call yourself a mother. <laughs> Go and serve your kids some... Even salad is better than nothing. Miss Bessa, once you've done your homework, which is improving his fun... Oh my goodness, guys. I could kiss you sometimes. That would be so inappropriate, but you know what I mean. Oh, there's a flower here. A daisy. Okay, that's worth practically nothing, but still. Uh, Spencer, once you've done that, hopefully you can kind of hurry your, your bum up with that. Right, the little darling. Get your homework done. Get your homework done. Horrifying quality of mac and cheese. You're an embarrassment. Seriously. <laughs> You're supposed to be a good mum. Okay, grab a plate. Oh, she's already grabbing a plate. Oh, City Hall was pleased to see your pile of permission slips. I should hope so. Right, so come on home, boys. Come on home, my little soldiers. All right, mister, I want you... What are you going to do? Oh, look, he's going to clean that. How nice is he? Pick the daisy. And then I want you to come over here. Oh, oh, camera's going crazy. I want you to smoke the bees. See, I'm getting there, guys. I am getting there. Smoke the box. I harvest the honey. Feed the bees. Feed the bees. Get him to do that. All right, Missy, and now you've done that, let's see if we can get a last ditch attempt at Mr. Walter. So let's just invite him out. And let's see if he'll do it. Hurry up and eat your autumn salad. Come on. You don't have much time before the kids are all ready to wake up. I'm going to pass on the multi tab to Sophia and let her do her homework on that as well. Um, and then once the boys come home, they can also get their homework done as well. Okay. Oh, yeah. 75, $70. Oh, dollars, simoleons, whatever. Okay, so I want to take you to the festival. You better say yes, or I'm not going to be a happy girly. You better, Walter. You better. Okay, try calling back in one hour. Alright then, fine. Fine. I should probably just invite him over. I should, probably should. How many sims have we got? Two, four, six. We've got eight, so... We could still possibly have twins. Because we've got portrait panel. So, yeah. Right, what are you doing, Charlie? Get your homework done. Do homework with your brother. Where is Molly? She's doing her homework. Good girl. Good ghetto. And the twins hmm, are probably close to waking up. Listen to complaint. Why are you complaining? You do not like school. Well, that's not my problem. Not my problem. Alright, come and sell Spencer's painting. Spencer, how are you getting on? You getting on good? Okay, and how is the honey? Is it is it alright? Is it rubbish? Let's sell that. So what we can do is we can gather some of this and then we can consign it. Grab a plate. Is that been an hour? Let's just invite him over, actually. No, because I want I do want to collect some stuff. And the festival ground has a whole bunch of flowers. So he better meet us there. She's so tired too. Yeah. 
What I should really be doing and what would be completely sensible would be to work on the twins' skills, but you know, it's me and I kind of do things the wrong way, so I'm going to end up with like four toddlers. <laughs> <laughs> Four toddlers and it's going to be madness. Right, come and eat your autumn salad. Have you done your homework or are you just... What, what are you doing, Molly, darling? Have you done your homework? Yes, you have. Oh, well done. Well done. That's fine. I'll let you do that. that I'll let you do that. So come and empty these potties, actually. And that would be great. Spencer, what can we get you to do, honey? So let's let you get Nicole up. And have you met Walter yet? Walter, why are you wearing a ripped t-shirt, Walter? Friendly, get to know. Friendly, ask a single. Friendly, gossip. Funny, tell funny story. Back to Spencer. We're multitasking, guys. We are multi Oh, she was like a hello vampire. Scary. Yes, absolutely. Right, Spencer, so let's feed her on the floor. And then let's get Portia up and feed her on the floor because no doubt she'll be a screaming and crying in just a second. How are you two getting on? Hopefully, like, a what is that? Yeah, okay, well as soon as they're friends I can get her to make a silly face, friendly, high five them, friendly, friendly hug. Okay, so let's search for festival eggs, why not? Okay. Alrighty then, so feed on floor. Has Nicole finished? Nicole has Wonderful. So I know that you're tired, I know that you are, but I want you to teach her to talk, please, Spencer. Have you done your homework yet? <laughs> Sophia, do your homework. Don't test my patience, darling, don't test my patience. Um, she's hungry, but she's pretty much all right. Once you've done that, you can play on there. What is going on? Oh, no. Okay, Spencer was like that. No. <laughs> I am not teaching anybody to talk. Do you not see how tired I am? No, don't read it to sleep at. Do you have something against doing your homework? Do you? Do you have something against that? And can you not actually just go to bed on your own? Yes, good. Good, good. Okay. These girls are learning their, their mad skills, right? How are you getting on over here? So she's searching for some eggs. So do you actually get anything for I've never done it, so I don't really I don't really know what it does. Okay, he's heading home. Okay. But the group outing was fantastic. Excellent, that's what I like to see. So she's searching for eggs. I've never done it. I know you're probably thinking Laura, how long have you had this game and you've never searched for eggs? I genuinely haven't. I genuinely haven't. I don't know what it does. But I wish she would hurry up because I really just want to collect the flowers. Like, that's what's important to me. Come on. What does this actually do? Yeah, right, stop searching for eggs. And go and pick your flowers. Come on. Pick. Sweet William. Because there's normally a couple of Cosmos, like, kicking about. So. And someone also said that if you... Uh, if you sell them right away, then you will get more value for them. So I do plan on doing that as well. I'm sure that there was Cosmoses. Am I just... What's that? Oh, a pygmy hedgehog catch. I'm sure that there was cosmoses. I'm sure there was. Please tell me there was. Because they're a lot of money and I need a lot of money. <laughs> I, I need, I need, I need money, 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 money. What the heck? What's a nut hatch? Oh, it's a bird. Cute. I don't know if she can catch it or whether she has to make friends with it and all that crap. I don't really want to make friends with the bird. I want to sell the bird. That's what I want to do. Indian blanket. Let's pick that. 
So the cosmos is eluding me. It is. It's, I can feel it laughing in my face. Did we say to pick this one? Possibly. Who's this? Giovanni. Did we say to pick this, Daisy? Another Sweet William. Stuff your Sweet Williams. I don't really... All we're getting is Black Eyed Susans and Sweet Williams. Oh, well that's an egg. Perhaps because it's the silly egg hunt is the reason that we're not seeing any. Or it could be because I am pretty much blind. <laughs> well, I'm not actually even partly blind, but you understand my meaning. Yeah, there's definitely not, is there? No? Am I just sending us on a merry goose chase here? Alright, she's got quite a few flowers, so I'll probably... Is she coming over here? Are you coming over here to pick this? Yeah, don't tell me you're tired, because I, I don't really care, darling, at this point in time. I need you to pick the flowers, because the kiddies are doing stuff, so you have to as well. So once she's done that, I am going to sell the flowers, exactly like you have told me to do. Oh, nice. Okay. Nice, not so nice, not so nice, and what about this one? <gasps> oh, oh, I like that. I like that indeed. All right, what about this little? Oh my goodness, the heck, the hedgehog, <laughs> the hedgehog is worth six hundred odd simoleons. Cheerio. Goodbye. Thanks for thanks for donating to our cause and giving us money. I appreciate it. So that was quite successful. So we're friends with Mr. William and we have made ourselves quite a bit of dosh. So Laura is happy with that. Is that another one? An Eastern box turtle. Oh no, don't snow again. Like, please don't snow again. Please don't snow again. Okay, kiddies, how are you doing? How are you doing? So she's putting Nicole in there. Nicole, right. Sophia, darling. Let's have a wee look at Nicole. Nicole does not actually need to go on there. She needs to be tickled. I feel quite bad, actually, that Sophia is having to, to do this. <laughs> but mummy will be home soon and she will be using the bathroom. Right, let's go ahead and do that with Nicole. What else does she need? She needs her... She needs changed. So change her diaper. And what else does she need? She needs to do a pee. So put her down. Put Nicole down here. And what about her? So mum's coming in. Let's have a cuddle. So let's snuggle her. Change a diaper and toss in there. I know you're tired. I know you're so so tired. I'm not gonna get a perfect pregnancy again. I can I can feel it. <laughs> I'm not doing well enough for a perfect pregnancy. Sad times, guys. Oh, he's worth twenty one simoleons. He's he's rubbish. Indian blanket is four hundred. I didn't know Indian blanket was worth as much as that. Excellent, guys. We are racking up the dosh here, which is good. So you can just go to sleep. And what else do you need? You need the toilet. No, no, no. Don't put her in there. Like, I want you to put her... What? Like, put her down here. Um, right, okay. And I would quite like to get some more sort of toys for them to play with. Um, And then just you use... The toilet. Right, Sophia, let's get you to bed, honey. Let's get you to bed. You are going to be so tired tomorrow. Right, what other toys could we get the girls to play with? Because they don't really have much entertainment since everybody else is going to bed. So what could we do for them? Um, will we get them a toy chest? We could do. We could get them a toy chest since we have some money now. We get them a truck to play with, but it's not very educational. Um, or we could buy them a building blocks type thing. And I think that they do play with each other if we do get it. So can we get a pink one or a red one? Yes, we can. Oh, it's so cute. It's like a turtle. I like it. So we'll come and we'll get them to go and play with blocks. I don't know whether they get any socialite it. 
But it would be good if they did. Oh my goodness, the sink is just flooding the house. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to skip to the morning and we will pick up then. Alrighty guys, so it is the morning and this place is a disaster. We've got two broken sinks. Everywhere is disgusting. So I am going to call the repair technician because I just I just have to <laughs> because this place is a disaster. She's pregnant and we're going to have a really crapola pregnancy because of the fact that the place is a disaster. So let's go ahead and get her something to eat. Oh my goodness, this, I need to get this place sorted. Look at the state of it. Look at it. Look at it. It's just disgusting. <laughs> it's absolutely vile. Right, um, what can we do? So, who has your... I think she's got the multi-tab. So you can come... Right, come and... Do, 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 where is the feed on floor? Oh, she's already doing it. What a good mum. And Nicole, will you need the same? You probably will. Yep, yeah, absolutely. Um, and here's our repair woman. Oh, she's got nice hair. Um, come and use the potty chair once you've done that. And come and use the potty chair once you've done that. This house is a disaster. Absolute disaster. But that's okay. Who am I scolding? Like, why are you not at school, Molly? No, don't scold. Please don't scold her. I don't like it when they scold them. Please don't scold them. <laughs> Oh, please don't scold. Okay, I think, Molly, you should maybe go to school, honey. You little rebel. Let's get your butt in school. When you go. What's wrong with you? Do you need reset, honey? Is that what it is? That's a shame. So she's getting into trouble because the game screwed her over. Poor Molly. Poor Molly. Where is she? Good golly, Miss Molly. Go to school. There you go. Molly, what do you mean you can't go? Molly, don't give me that rubbish. Get your butt to school, please. Yeah, so something's wrong with her. Oh, don't talk about heel, because there's no picture. So I have reset her. Let's try it again. Reset Sim, yes. She's still got no picture. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no, this isn't good guys, no. This isn't good at all. Right, just come in here then, just now. I know she's absent-minded and whatnot, but, you know, you know. What if I actually select the school? Uh, let's see if that works. I don't think it will, because there seems to be... Oh no, that that's working, although her face isn't appearing. Okay, so... <gasps> Right, okay. So she is doing that. Excellent. And what about you? So can you go to the toilet, please? Go and use the potty chair. And Natasha's just going to clean up. So guys, I know this has kind of been a bit, I guess, doing tasks and doing all different sorts of stuff, but she will be having the baby in the next part. Deliver a common relic. No! Ain't nobody got time to go to Egypt. I don't think so. So yeah, the chances of Natasha having a perfect pregnancy after this episode <laughs> is probably slim to none. But, you know, this this is what happens. You could really do with a maid. Can't afford a maid though. And then the maid helps with the kids and we can't really have anybody. What is wrong with you guys? Did you just get fed? Why Why are you hungry again? You greedy guts. You absolute greedy guts. Feed her on the floor. Or maybe she didn't get fed. Maybe maybe there was a problem. Perhaps there was. <laughs> Go and feed her. Go and feed her. Come on, we can always come back in, mop up this puddle, and clean. I'll tell you, Natasha, I would not like to be you. <laughs> I would not like to be you. Right, you're tired. Just do something just for a second. 
and then your mum will come and sort you out she will and that is my timer guys to say that this part is over like i say natasha will be having her baby in the next part i'm hoping on all hopes that it's twins i don't know what's going on oh she's back good um that kind of panicked me a little bit because i love molly and i was like no please don't let you know anything be wrong um need to get these kids i mean she's going to have her oh my goodness she's going to have her babies and we're going to have four toddlers if we have twins we're going to have four toddlers or if we have triplets we might have five freaking toddlers so slightly concerned about the next pregnancy but also looking forward to it as well so thank you so much for joining me have a fantastic day guys and i'll talk to you in the very next part bye guys